Hi, this lesson is gonna be hard because we are going to refactor the model name it loader and we are going to learn now again how to load a model and its animations at once but using premises in a way that you can use just one model uh, one module in order to do everything at once but get ready because it's gonna be hard so the first things we are going to do is remember that what is the victim <laughs> in this case it's gonna be this uh, module ECMAScript script 6 as you remember we have a model and we have only one animation but now we want to load many animations so we were working with promises we need to do some stuff similar to it using promise all um you will see but as you can see we were resolving the promises in in other places we are going to resolve the promises in the same file so you're gonna get some work but hopefully it's gonna be easy to follow and we will see so we are going to start and we and i will get uh, the reference in the other script so at the beginning we are going to create a class named loader and we are going to have a constructor method and we are going to receive a model model file url and then the url animation list that we have already created but we need to process in order to uh, add in the folder to the beginning of the files files and then the scale that is something that we were working outside of the, this module so this constructor method is going to be huge comparing compared with the previous uh, we were watching in these uh, tutorials but take it easy so now we are going to create a loader as a new fbx loader and then we are going to create a, an array name it animation premises animation promises and then we are going to create an, another array name it animations where we are going to collect the animations in order to put them all of them into the model and then the model promise const model promise which will be new promise with uh, rest reg and we are going to use the loader this loader that load the model file url let me see this and then we're going to use the function that we where we receive the object that we are going to handle scaling up or scaling up down so object dot scale dot set the scale 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 and now we are going to copy paste some um, functionality that we are going to learn in the future videos related to the shadows and the illuminations in, in, in other level knowing and studying deeply and after that we are going to call the callback response and sending the object we are going to send the object this is the first step we need to which is uh, load the model 
The second step is load the animation. So we have an array named animation list that we are going to iterate with a for lead for each for each. Yeah. And we are going to use the index of them. So we are going to use the animations list promises and we are going to use the index of the array and we are going to use the new promises promise we are going to have the callbacks res and reg injection Now we are going to load this load this dot load hey where is it loader where is it where are you yeah loader sorry my friend but I need to fix you up this loader oh what happened there oh my goodness my goodness almost it was close loader low yeah another mistake load loader load early in the morning <laughs> so now we need to pass the url animation list with this index And then we are going to use the function that we have an object to handle. Um, let me check this out. Yeah, now we are going to scale it down or scale it up. Depends on what we need. And then we are going to use these animations with this index but we are going to multiply by one in order to casting to an integer 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 and it's gonna collect the object but animations just the first element because every file contain only one animation only animation we have download in a file that file contains just one animation that's why we just use the first one and after it we don't need to respond but we are going to response sending the index so once we have this done we need to join all these promises in just one promise so we need to create a const uh, joiner promise it will be promise.all we need to pass the this animation promises so now we have the model promise and the joiner promises joiner promise yeah we have two promise so it's time to join them the model and the animations and we are going to do it in promise name model that we are going to access from a getter property of this class and it will be a new promise with its callback response and rejects Um, it is going to contain uh, promise all and we are going to put here the model promise model promise and the joiner promise 
and when they are ready we're going to have data and from the data we are going to use just the first one because yeah we are going to create let or const it's the same const object it's gonna be the first uh, element remember the model promise is the model that we are work loading here is this one um then we need to ask if these um animations animations dot length length are higher than zero it means there are animations we need to put into the object animations array this array that contain the animations so hopefully you can follow it and now we need to call the callback and we need to send the object with those animations and after that remember these animations let me check yeah i am uh, indexing i am indexing this animation with uh, numbers because i want to access them using numbers even when they are strings so take it watch out because it can cause some problem but if you follow my tutorial you will avoid them or you could avoid them um, now we need to create the only one method of this class which is get model and we are going to return this model which is promise of a promise of promise of a promises <laughs> but uh, i think there is no confusion here maybe some mistyping hopefully 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 not but that's all by now we need to okay we need to export the class name export by default default my friend <laughs> the loader and now it's gonna be easier load a model and his its animations that's all by now stay around for more tips like this so see you in the following lessons stay around